In this lesson, we are going to study subtraction of integers. We can use the number line to subtract integers. Let's look at the rule associated with this. When subtracting a negative number, it means we are moving to the right of the number line. Don't forget, in the rule for addition, we said when adding a negative number, it means we are moving to the left. So this is the exact opposite of addition of integers. And also when we are subtracting a positive number, then it means we are moving to the left. So take note, when subtracting a negative number, we move to the right. A positive number, we move to the left. And one thing we should notice, the subtraction of a negative number always becomes addition. We we'll understand that as we go on with the lesson. So the first example we have 2 minus 10. So minus 10 here indicates is the subtraction. This is the subtraction sign of a positive number. And subtraction of a positive number means we move to the left. So starting from the number 2. We are going to move to the left 10 times. Let's do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. So it falls on minus 8 to show that 2 minus 10 is equal to minus 8. The next example, we have 7 minus negative 8. So this is a subtraction of a negative number. Then we said subtraction of a negative number becomes addition. So this is what we meant by that. It becomes 7 plus 8, which is equal to 15. Well... We might also try that on the number line. We said when subtracting a negative number means we are moving to the right. So the right of 7, 8 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. That is falling on 15. So 7 minus minus 8 which is the same as 7 plus 8 is equal to 15. You can jot this down then we continue with the lesson. <laughs> 